Hi everybody, and welcome back to another session of Let's Play Neverwinter Nights Shadows of Undertide with me, John Zeitberg1417, with young Goofeth and his direwolf animal companion, Flash. Who's a good boy? Who's a good boy? Yes, you're a good boy! No, oh, he's so cute. Let's pet him. Goofeth is very, very happy to have him around. All the more so because he's feeling... Well, not that fairly treated, to be completely honest, by Drogon. I mean, he expected this sort of treatment from uh, Ayala, but Drogon pretty much just told him, well, now you're graduated and let's be off to the Anorak Desert and do my bidding. He thinks he deserved a bit more respect after being the top pupil and everything and helping get him back on his feet after being poisoned. He's going to go to the Anorak Desert to do this errand for Drogon. Ah, uh, no, that's the one with the Shadow Heart. We still haven't found that, but he's not going to go hunting out there just for it, because it would be too much out of his way. Um, uh, where, where is it? Yeah, uh, we're, we're supposed to seek out a man by the name of Garrick Halasa in the Anorak Desert to identify... Um, the crystal that was hidden in the tower statuette. Um, no, that's the dragon's tooth. That's which we're hanging on to just in case. And there's a quartz crystal. No, that's a quartz crystal. The adventure. That's the tower crystal. There we go. Uh, unusually strong magical aura. We still don't know what this dragon's tooth does, but Goof is not going to hand it into the harpers. He kind of wiggled his way around that until he knows what exactly they're up to. But yeah, he's going to do that, he's going to do that errand for Drogon, but he hopes that after that he'll show a bit more appreciation for him. He's getting really uneasy, so... And uh, distrustful of his surroundings, so it's a really good thing that Flash is around to keep him company. And as I said in the last session, he's going to take really good care of him, because it's unlikely that he'll be able to resurrect Flash once he dies. Although, technically, the game allows me to simply call and recall him as much as I want, but that's not how I'm going to play it. And, yeah, Flesh is going to be sent off to safety as soon as it gets dangerous. So he himself can be resurrected, Flesh can't. And I actually don't think we need anything. I am going to... Um, I am going to go to the store again. And uh, see if there's anything we need or, or can buy or that might be helpful. Because we don't really know what we're going to be up against. We just know that we're going to be traveling to the desert. As you know, Gufoth hates deserts. It's going to be hot and he's going to get a headache. And, yeah, but, well, needs to be done. Apparently. And then, I think Drogon told us... We're going to find out if that's true or not. But I think Drogon told us that... Oh no, it's just a locked door. Okay, okay. We're halting, halting our actions. We're not a vandal, don't attack us. Hilltop guard. We just picked the wrong door. All is well, see? Putting away my bow. We'll cooperate. Um, who are you? It's a long day. I can use a drink. I cannot believe I got kicked out of my house by the dressed wizard. It's some kind of permit from the major. Where will I sleep? Oh, so there are ramifications to our decision to get the red wizard in here. Is that your house? Thigh Mart! Opening soon! Well, he didn't lose any time. I think we're going to check that out. Anyway, what I wanted to say is, uh... Dogen told us, I think, that we could actually speak to the caravan leader. Pretty... Pretty halfling. Go for the kind of has a crush on. If uh, we're ready to go, so we're going to do that. Go for that's been aching to get a chance to talk to her again. Yeah, there he is. Zarin and a Thavian slave. Goofoth doesn't like that at all. Hello. Salutations. Greetings, Goofoth, my friend. As you can see, we have a lot of unpacking to do. Fortunately, I was able to find some help. Was there anything you wanted? 
he does have a dragon's egg to sell, and the Thavian visit would be a good choice. Would you be interested in that? Kufa, if you never fail to surprise me, there is a great market for such things in Thai. I could offer you 700 gold or an interesting magic item I recently acquired. Well, I think we're good to go with gold at the moment. We're 4,000. The item is a cloak that belonged to a friend of mine in Thai. When we were young and in school together, his cloak came quite handy, as the blue glow it gave off protected us from a fire trap. Hmm. Sounds like a uh, cloak of protection against cold. Mm, I think we're going to get it, because I think it will be worth even more than 700 gold pieces. The nymph cloak he likes for the time being, but he's going to keep the other one just in case. The chap was supposed to seal off the pleasure slave area from the younger students. Needless to say, our education was that much superior to that of our classmates. So which would you prefer? Take the cloak, I think. Though I am loath to part with it, I have no need for it either. I am pleased that we could do business once again. Is there anything else you would like? Let's take a look at that cloak first. There it is. Ooh, looks snazzy. Ah, we have it to identify it first. What? Protects from fire? Well, that's not bad either. When the caravans begin to arrive, then I will have proper supplies. Unfortunately, I have only a few things to offer you, but I will give you big prices. Okay, favorable, yeah. Uh, first of all, let's identify that cloak. Armor class bonus plus one. I think we already have the deflection modifier, but uh, we'll see. No, we don't! He is going to wear that in that case. And it looks really snazzy too. Look at that. It's got the... Uh, not bad. Um, yeah, let's sell the nymph cloak in that case. He has two of those now, okay. Immunity against fear, bonus no plus two, we don't need that. Just going to browse a bit, I think. Do I have anything to sell? Uh, not really. He is going to inquire if he'd like to buy the dragon's tooth, but I doubt he's going to sell it if, because it's his, his assurance, insurance against the harpers pretty much, so I doubt he's going to sell it unless he gets a really good deal. Okay, we don't need that. Do we have enough? Yeah, we do have enough arrows. Ah, uh, how are we potion-wise? Not bad. Um, both strength we don't need. Antidote... We don't have any antidotes. Those might come in handy. Ah, uh, two are enough. And... There they are. I need to rearrange my equipment at some point. It's not all that good. Good for now. We need all of that, really. Yeah, we kind of do. Um, guess we can put those in here for the time being. Restoration? Nah. Um, doubt he'll have any... Did we... Okay, we did put the magic fang in there, that's good. Do you have any divine spells? I doubt it, but... Might be. Hmm. Okay, no, that's Potion of Clarity. No, not really. Owl's Wisdom, Fox's Cunning, Endurance. We have enough of all of those. Okay, it's Grace. I think another one of Endurance might be good for buffing purposes. Acid resistance, no, we have the natural armor plus one already. Scabbard of blessing, what does that do? Eight and bless, three times a day. How much for that? Oh, way too much. Uh, do we have, yeah, we have two focus crusts, but we don't even know if we can use that in any way in the Anorak Desert. So... Yeah, that should be it. But about that slave... Well, first of all, before we get angry, let's see if we can get an estimate on that dragon's tooth. 
An excellent specimen, and it seems to have some magical properties. Still, it would need to be used by the right craftsman to make it into something usable. I once saw something very similar, made by a kobold of all things. It is unfortunate that I do not know any kobold craftsmen, but I imagine my contacts in thigh might know what to do with it. The tooth is powerful, yet it will cost me a good sum of gold to transform it into something useful. Best I can offer you is 500 gold. It must be worth more than that. No, there's too much risk involved. What if I cannot find anyone to shape it into something useful? 500 gold or nothing. That's the best I can do. No, he hang on to it. Don't be so smug. Nothing, thanks. Okay, about this slave business. We don't like that. Gufith doesn't like that. People keep in slaves. Just better life out here than back in thigh. Oh, you're still a slave, but... It doesn't seem we can do anything about it at the moment. Over for this half a mind to just sick flash at that wizard, but there we go. Um, and just a quick stop over at the other stores to see if there may be there are maybe some magical weapons or something along those lines. Maybe Fiona has a rapier plus one. That would help. You need to clean that blood stain off your floor, lady. It's unhygienic. Hail and well met. I'd like to see you good. Favorable, now she likes him. I think that happened once before. Uh, Donna, it's a regular rapier, right? No. No. No, it doesn't look like it. Um, do you have... You have ice arrows, but they're awfully expensive. Um, I, I... 